The first case of the deadly Chinese coronavirus making its way to the U.S. And these new actions are a mandate this time. They are not recommendations. They're part of an executive order by the governor. Cleanup and relief efforts in southeastern Kentucky. Governor Andy Bashir looked it over today, calling it one of the worst flooding events on record. Stearns Heritage Hall back there checked in got my bib getting ready to start the uh, well we're getting ready to load up on the buses to go do the Yamacraw 50k absolutely beautiful weather right now should be amazing uh, looking forward to it it's gonna be fun just curious to see how the uh, how my ankle does and yeah just gonna enjoy the day so we'll see what happens get ready to go do this but um, we're just we're thrilled to have y'all here. It's go time. All right, we're underway. Finally thinned out just a little bit to where we can run. Had a little climb there at the start. Most people started log jamming it up. We're moving now. Three mile check in, feeling pretty good so far. Moving along steadily. Got a little group of us here. Ankle feels pretty solid so far, so hopefully it's a good sign. Creek crossing number three so far. Ah, oh, I didn't manage to stay dry. Oh wow. Is this Princess Falls, I guess? Must be Princess Falls back there. Checking in almost seven miles, 817 feet of gain so far. Coming up to a power line cut, getting close to the first aid station. Say hey, Mike. What's up, man? <laughs> first aid station. Looks like, like not going to the A station yet, another three miles. <laughs> that goes Mike, way over there. Well, 
little over 10 and a half miles. Moving pretty well. I had one issue where I landed on my right foot on a rock that was sloped downward and my toes went down quickly. That did not feel good on the ankle at all. So gotta watch out for that. Otherwise feeling okay. I just left aid station two, about 11.2 miles in. Grabbed a bag of potato chips, filled up with some hydration drink, and we're good to go. Keep on moving. All right, 15 mile check in. Um, it's going okay. I left a pack back there and I've just been pretty much on my own the last several miles hoping I'm going the right direction because <laughs> this is the only part of the course that we repeat it's like a 1.9 mile section or something like that so I'm hoping I don't miss a turn drinking lots of water and hydration drink take a couple gels you know just popped my first salt pill it's warm Well, I found my turn I needed to make. Luckily, there were some nice volunteers there to point people in the right direction. Oh, hopefully that's the last of the sand. Nice job. Leaving the aid station, heading up to the road right now. I did pop some Advil because my ankle was feeling a little tight but uh, I'll make do. There's 17 miles. Little bridge section to get across here, then I think we're gonna hop back on some trail real quickly. <laughs> Thank you all. Time to get the feet wet, no way about it now. Oh, it feels so good. Ah, oh, that felt great. Now we'll see how these uh, Peregrine 11 shoes dry and see if this tape job holds on my ankles. <laughs> 20 mile check-in. Going up a long douche grade climb right now. Just gradual. Enough to make you not want to run. Level that a little bit. Just taking the aid station to aid station. Ah, and these freaking horse flies, man. Here, I'll do this, you get something Thank else. You. Um, hey, Ashley. I'm twisting ankles. Yeah, I don't need more of those. We've got water down here. We've got water. Um, like water, water, water in that okay. Yeah, I need mean, popsicles. Yeah. Do you care what color? No, I don't care. Yeah. Awesome, thank you. Mm -hmm. You got anything else you need? Um, how far are you? To the next? To the next one, it is 5.2. I'm sorry, how much? 5.2. Any more, anything else you need? For the next phase? I don't think so. 50K? Yeah, 50k. Mmm. Yeah. Popsicle is awesome. A station was great. Talked to the doctor that helped me out at no business. He, re he recognized me. So 
So that was cool. Feeling pretty good. 21 miles in. Uh, yeah, almost 2,200 feet of climbing. Moving pretty well. This part of the course looks familiar to me. Like I think I might have been on this at no business. It would have been almost sunrise when I was up here before though. But I do remember somewhat this. this sort of. Ah. Oh. Ah. Cut the toe, pulled the foot backwards. That motion does not feel good on the ankle. Ah. Mm. Keep moving. I'll be all right. Keep moving. <clears throat> Just came up a steep, steep road climb. And it was power hiking up that thing. It was steep, I'm not kidding. But right in front of me is Emily, the fourth place female, trying to track down a podium spot. I think she can do it. She's determined. And she is moving well. All right, 25 mile check-in. Feeling okay, starting to feel the legs feel like they're getting close to that cramping point. So I did take some more salt pills. I've been drinking a ton. It's just a conditioning thing. I'm not conditioned the way I need to be. But otherwise I feel okay. Moving along right now at about 825 on this hot gravel section. Trying to get to that last aid station. There goes Emily. All right, just left the last aid station. Seven miles to the finish. Five hours and nine minutes so far. So, moving pretty well, considering everything, so I'm happy. But man, this is hot right now, this is all exposed. Whew. I had like probably a whole orange back there, it was so good. All that potassium, moving along. Well, 30 mile check-in. I don't even know if you can see me because this lens is so dirty. I uh, just had a massive hamstring cramp. I had to take a uh, salt pill, open it up, and put it straight under the tongue. And just let it sit there for a minute. Hopefully uh, that'll help. Stave it off another. I got three miles. Three miles is all that's left. Give or take. And it's a little bit of climbing, so I need to get moving again. All right, just passed a true 50k distance, 31 miles. So about two miles left. Bringing it home. Poor uh, Emily, the uh, fourth place female. She's right back there, but she was in front of me, but she caught a toe and went down pretty hard. I think she's okay though, but I stopped and made sure she was okay, but she's moving. So I'm still over like, I don't know, over a mile away, but I'm up high and I could just hear a bunch of screaming. So the finishing area is somewhere that way and I'm getting somewhat close, but sound does travel. Pretty cool. Hopefully that'll give me a little bit of energy I need to finish. I just ate one more gel, a Huma strawberry gel. I love those. 
and uh, almost out of water. So I hope it's close. I'll get you too. <laughs> Gonna do it. Pretty good time too for well for me with no training. Thank you. done finished um, like a 627 and 16th place surprisingly so I'm super happy with that especially with not training at all <laughs> so got this cool uh, it's like a rubber cup it's awesome and a really nice looking metal handed to you by the best metal distributor ever that's right my wife was able to give me the metal pretty cool so it's a good day legs feel pretty good um, just need to work on some conditioning so we'll see Thanks for watching. Appreciate you all. Hope you have a, uh, a good day. Talk to you later.